After losing everything, I had become a little depressed, you know. I have lumbar spinal stenosis, and what it caused was severe pain to go down the sciatic nerve. I had the injections done to the lumbar, and it put it in remission for two years. Then it returned with a vengeance. Lost everything, my job, my, my home, everything. I was homeless, literally, because it returned, and I couldn't do anything. I couldn't work. I couldn't do anything. I started looking for doctors, and I went to one doctor, and he said that there was no way he would do surgery on my back. And I said, well, I want another opinion. She saw the x-rays, and she told me that some doctors will tell you that they can't do surgery on you, but that doesn't mean that you can't have surgery, is what she was saying, you know. She said, I think what it's going to do is get you back to walking, and you can throw away that walker. And I said, you can get me to walking without being in pain? She said, you may have a little back pain, but she said, no more pain in your legs. I just let her know that if there was some chance of me walking again without being in pain, that I would embrace it. And as far as Abrazo Central Hospital, I mean, they took they took good care of me, you know, and that's why I was did so well when I went home, because they started me in the hospital, you know telling me positive, encouraging things, you know, and talked to me and asked me if I had any questions for, you know, as far as the healing process and all that, you know. And it's actually been about eight months since my surgery and I have no pain. It's like a whole new world, you know, being able to walk without pain. I really felt happy and excited about life again. I had goals to get back to work, to have a life. I would like to say to all of them, thank you very much. You are all wonderful and you're all still wonderful. You know, they seem like they really care, that it's not just about a dollar bill, but they really seem like they want to help people.